prove that there exist two irrational numbers, a and b, such that a to the b is rational. So basically we're trying to prove that it's possible to have an irrational number to an irrational number equal a rational number. So we're going to prove um, that this is actually possible in mathematics. So proof. And this is a really, really, really famous proof. So the proof goes uh, as follows. So we start by letting a be equal to the square root of 2 to the square root of 2, and b be equal to the square root of 2. Then note the following observation. We're trying to look at a to the b. So if you look at a to the b, that's equal to the square root of 2 to the square root of 2, and that whole thing is being raised to the b, which is also square root of 2. What you do here is you multiply the powers, right? So the square root of 2 times the square root of 2 is 2. So this is the square root of 2 to the 2. And when you square the square root of 2, you just get 2. So this is clearly rational, because 2 is a rational number. So a to the b is rational in this case. So now we just have to discuss whether or not uh, a and b are rational or irrational. So here's how uh, this proof goes. This is really, really beautiful. So first, we'll look at the following case. So if a, which is equal to the square root of 2, to the square root of 2. Let's suppose this is irrational. So if it is irrational, then we are done. And let me explain why. So then we are done with the proof. Because if it's irrational, then we have an, let me use a different color here. This is not part of the proof. So if it's irrational, then we're done. And the reason is we have a to the b. a is irrational. And we all know that b is the square root of 2. That's also irrational. So we have irrational to the irrational equal to 2, which is rational. So case 1 was if the square root of 2 to the square root of 2 is irrational. Then we're done, because then we have irrational to irrational equal rational. Case 2 is if it's rational. So if a equals square root of 2 to the square root of 2 is rational, then believe it or not, we are also done. Then again, we are done. And I'll explain why. It's really, really cool. And again, we are done. And the reason is as follows. I'll use a different color for emphasis. In this case, we have, I'll call it a prime equal to the square root of 2, b prime equal to the square root of 2. And if you look at what we've written here, we're saying that the square root of 2 to the square root of 2 is rational. So we have a prime to the b prime equals rational. But we all know that the square root of 2 is irrational. So we basic, we're basically saying we have irrational to the irrational equals rational. So in any case, we've shown that it's possible to come up with two numbers such that you have an irrational number raised to an irrational number equal to a rational number. I hope this video made sense. If it does make sense, it's a really cool proof. If it doesn't make sense, watch it again. That's it.